2025 is here and if you want to take your career and your life to the next level, you have to be using AI tools. Hi everyone, I'm Ishan Sharma and in the past one year, I've gone through hundreds of AI tools myself, tried them out and came up with a list of nine comprehensive tools which have completely changed the way I do my work. In this video, I'll share those entire nine tools, how I use it in my particular workflow and at the end, I'll also share with you some new tools which are coming up in 2025, which can be life changing for you in your own workflow as well. All I ask for you is to hit the like button and let's get started with the first tool and that is HeyGen. I have personally used HeyGen to create my own custom AI avatar and the results are incredible. Look at these reels right now. These were not recorded by me. I was not sitting in front of the camera like I'm doing right now. This was created completely with the help of HeyGen. So the way it works is that you record a five minute video of yourself talking to the camera, doing your usual hand movements, having your expressions and then putting that video into HeyGen and in just about an hour or less than that, your AI avatar is good to go. And this is completely free for getting started. I do have a paid plan which I'm paying HeyGen for, but this is an incredible tool because it now saves my time. And guess what? I'm actually selling this as a service to founders in the US. The way it works is that we tell them that, hey, the most important thing for you is your time. And we, as an agency, is gonna give you back your time. How? We will make an AI avatar for you and we will create videos and content on your behalf so that you can do what ma matters the most to you, which is building your own company. And it sells like crazy. Everyone wants to get a bite of that. That is an insane opportunity that we are working on right now, but this tool is incredible. The type of videos it creates, it feels so natural and you cannot tell the difference. But HeyGen is incomplete without the next tool I'm gonna talk about and that is Eleven Labs. Eleven Labs is an insane AI tool if you want to create audio for yourself or you want to use another AI audio. The way it works is that you upload one to two hours of your audio of you speaking and it then creates your own AI voice avatar. So you do not have to record your voice again. You've built, you've trained this model now and it will automatically generate your own voice and the differences are very minimal. But the problem with this is it only gets better with more audio that you feed in. So ideally, the best AI avatar videos that you've seen on the internet by creators, they fed at least 10 hours of audio into that model to train it so that it feels very natural. Right? So that's essentially how 11 Labs works. I have used 11 Labs in collaboration with HeyGen to create my AI video reels that you might have seen on my Instagram. If you don't follow me there, what are you doing? You should follow me right there. Let's move on to the next tool and that is Suno. Suno AI, incredible tool if you want to create background audio, if you want to create music, which is your own custom music. So there is no problem with copyright issues. There is no singer or artist which is going to come after your life, taking all of your AdSense revenue. And it is really helpful for a creator like me. I have used epidemic music in the past. Suno AI is a amazing tool, which helps me generate my own custom background music along with those soundtracks that I can then use in my video itself, right? There's also other tools called SoundDraw and other ones, which basically take a look at the vibe of my video and create a custom background audio track for it. I think the biggest problem for creators who are creating vlogs and content in general is copyright issues. I remember the first video I made on my channel, you can still go and watch it, was a summary of what I did in the first month of me in Bits Pilani Goa campus as a college student. And that entire video had various different songs playing throughout it. And I had no clue about IP, about content rights, about music in general. And it instantly got demonetized the minute I made it live. And that is why tools like Suno AI is a godsend for people who want to create genuine content and make a living out of it as well. So that's the third tool which you should check out. The fourth one is called Notebook LM. Insane tool which I've been using recently to get summaries of anything which I am not able to read at the moment. So sometimes for me, whenever I'm traveling, right, could be in a car, could be in a flight, could be public transport, I'm not looking at my phone because whenever I do that, I get a headache sometimes. So what I do as an option is that I feed that blog into Notebook LM, which is an amazing tool by Google, and it gets me an audio podcast in which two people are talking about that particular blog or that particular video and summarizing it for me so that I get a clear picture of what this person is trying to say 
without having to read it on the go and that's a huge time saver for me i get to summarize so many incredible blogs by Paul Graham by Sam Altman by Gary Tan by Mark Andreessen by all of these people that i look up to using notebook lm and that is why i use it all the time that's an amazing use case of it i also use it to summarize and get my doubts cleared for particular documents that i have so for example if i have like a pdf of a book if i have a pdf of something that a company has sent me i can quickly feed that pdf on notebook lm and it gives me a clear representation of that book and i can ask any questions about it it gives me the highlights of the book of any pdf that i'm feeding and i can ask any question about it i get a very deeper insight into what that book or what that pdf is all about so incredible tool i think you all should use it it's completely free for you to check out you can feed in blogs you can feed in any documents that you might have you know dot doc dot ppt anything works you can also feed in like a proper youtube video and it will summarize it for you you can ask any questions to pdfs it is an amazing tool which you should definitely use if you haven't tried it out yet that's the fourth tool the fifth one on the other hand is called claude it's a tool built by anthropic i recently saw dario who's the founder talk about his vision for anthropic and claude in general and the most important use case for claude right now is for coding as well as for computer use so they have this new functionality called computer use in which you can actually ask it to do stuff and it will do it on a computer sandbox environment that it has created for you so it works amazingly well it's also great for coding so it has the 3.5 sonnet model which basically is amazing at coming up with components with little code snippets that you can use or even creating a whole program they have made little games just using the coding abilities of claude 3.5 sonnet it's pretty crazy what you can do with it with just typing natural language there's another tool which i talked about previously on my channel called pythagora ai which does something very similar but it is a little bit more advanced so you get to dial in the exact prompt the exact description of what you want and press enter and it will create it for you and you can deploy it with a second but that's how pythagora works try it out if you have not already but claude for computing and coding is amazing and you should definitely give it a go you don't even need to know how to code you should just be able to describe what you want and it will build it for you right in front of your eyes what a time to be alive i wake up i use these tools and it blows my mind how how easy everything is gotten right that's why i completely agree with sam altman who says that the next billion dollar company can be a single person company and everything else can be done by ai agents which i will come to by the end of this video if you keep watching but that is the fifth tool that you should check out the sixth one is not a tool but it's a hardware device it's called omi so i recently went to san francisco and i met the founder of omi which is nick and essentially what omi is it is like your companion so you wear it it's like a pendant it is will it will be here with you at all times and it will be connected to your phone on the omi app and the way it works is that let's say you are doing a lot of meetings so you meet a lot of people you are meeting friends omi will always be listening your conversations so it will hear who you are talking to and it can tell the differences in the voice so it will say person 1 person 2 and then your voice and then after that it will give you summaries of every single meeting you had with that person it's an insane tool and you can use it today i tried it myself i wore it i went out for a meeting it was able to transcribe everything that the person is speaking obviously it has to be in english and then it gave me summaries and i could ask any question about that discussion that i had that okay what was he talking about india or what was he talking about the o1 visa and it will give me a proper description about it and that is what blew my mind it had so many other features right you can save it you can turn that summary into tables into other formats and so much more right the possibilities is endless and it blew my mind just thinking about the applications of what all you can do with the help of omi so try it out i don't think you can get it in india but it's about 69 dollars if you are in the us you can get it from over there but incredible ai hardware tool i tried it for the first time myself and i loved using it the battery life is a little lesser so i'm just 
hoping that it gets better with time. The seventh tool which you should check out is Instantly or Apollo. So in the past six months or so, my marketing company has been focusing on cold outreach. So the way it works is that whenever I go to San Francisco or New York, my co-founder reaches out to lots of companies and founders saying that Ishan is going there. He would love to meet you. And can you schedule a call or not? So this happens at a mass scale. So we are sending hundreds of emails on every single campaign of every single trip of mine. And this happens seamlessly and every message is contextualized for that particular founder with the help of Instantly or Apollo. So we are able to create a list of our ideal customer persona on Apollo and then we are able to schedule and automate those emails with Instantly. And I just love how we are able to scale with it because Previously, what we were doing is we were sitting down and sending customized emails ourselves. We would write down exactly how can we help this particular company, but this does it in seconds and it can scale infinitely. And I get at least 10 to 15 calls booked every single time I'm going there. So I'm able to close at least two to three clients on every single visit and that is insane. Every single trip of mine has gotten free because I'm able to close clients. And that I think is the best part of using tools like Instantly and Apollo as a marketing company owner. So check it out if you want to get clients as a freelancer, if you want to get clients as a marketing agency owner, Instantly and Apollo are amazing tools which you should check out for cold outreach. Have a look at it. That was the seventh tool. The ninth one is for creating ultra realistic pictures of you doing anything, wearing anything using Flux AI. So Flux AI recently got viral on Twitter and it basically is like an API that you can use to generate ultra realistic pictures of yourself and people will not be able to tell a difference. There are so many people who are creating these images of girls, images of certain people doing certain things and seeing that this is AI generated and you cannot tell the difference. It looks so ultra realistic. So it's amazing for generating thumbnails. It's amazing for, for creating those social media banners, for creating these LinkedIn posts, for whatever you might want. It works really, really well. So check it out if you have not already for generating those ultra realistic pictures. Midjourney does a good job, but Flux AI is on another level right now. The last but not the least, my favorite tool whenever I'm doing AI search, and that is perplexity. The way it basically works is you would go on the platform and you can search up anything and it gives you real time results. And it is much better than Google. So if you've been Googling anything before to get the latest information about something, stop Googling and just go to perplexity and just start searching over there and you get real life information and it works really really well the founder arvind i got to meet him in san francisco and shoot a podcast with him if you have not seen it already go give it a watch i think he's one of the most driven people in the field of ai tools and chatbots and are doing some phenomenal work out there that is the last tool but now let me give you two new tools which are coming for this new year 2025 the first one is all about ai agents AI agents is on the rise. 2025 is going to be all about it and Google knows it well. So I was recently in a press briefing by Google and they unveiled Google Mariner, which is basically their AI agentic workflow. The way it works is that you go on Chrome and you basically open Google Mariner and you can just type anything that, hey, uh, find me the cheapest flight from San Francisco to Bangalore or, or check the emails of these few people and press enter and it will automatically do all those tasks for you without you having to go and do it manually yourself and it works really really well that is an insane tool that you can use to automate your tasks and get more things done faster that is why sam altman said that it is now today possible for a single person company to make a billion dollars in revenue all with the help of ai agents with a crazy margin right and it's not just Google who's doing it. OpenAI has this thing called the Swarm, OpenAI Swarm, which is all about, again, building your own AI agents. And even Salesforce has these AI agents that they are working on called Agent Force. So basically, this new year is going to be all about AI agents. I recently went to the Y Combinator office. I went to the Doc Patch area in San Francisco and I got to meet some incredibly driven founders who are building YC companies and they're all focusing on AI agents because that is the future. The future is all about instead of hiring employees, imagine if you could do all of the work, marketing, HR, accounting, any compliance work, any 
cold outreach, sales. Imagine doing all of that with the help of AI agents. And people are building some amazing solutions for it. So go check it out if you have not already. Google Mariner is amazing, especially because you can directly get access to it inside of your Chrome browser. So you can do a lot with it, right? Imagine you have written a list of 10 people you want to reach out to or 10 people you want to meet. You can at least have Mariner get their emails and give you more information about how can you reach out to them right in your browser and do it automatically on your behalf. Saves you time and the effort. That's AI agents. The next tool is open AI Sora. It's finally out in public. And I think this is the most revolutionary tool for video editors out there because we've all seen the amazing work that open AI Sora can do. But more importantly is the storyboarding feature. So we all know that Sora is great for creating certain frames, but you cannot make a whole storyline with it. But that's where the storyboarding feature comes in, in which you can describe particular frames and it will stitch together the whole scene for you. So that I think is incredible because now video editors for the first time will have an option to go in and create entire scenes without doing it themselves, without going to Pexels or Unsplash and other places and create ultra realistic video elements. It struggles a little bit with limbs whenever something is walking. So it just looks a bit weird, but for the most part, it looks incredibly real. There are so many things that you can do today with Sora, which you would have to do yourself manually, animating manually, and it would take you hours and hours and it could today be done in minutes with the help of Sora. And I think that is the biggest revolution for video editors out there. Check out OpenAI Sora if you have not already. OpenAI is doing this 12 days, 12 AI updates by OpenAI. And so they're releasing amazing new stuff every single day. And I think that's amazing about them. But these were essentially the nine tools which have changed my life forever. And the two tools to look out for in 2025, go try them out yourself and let me know in the comment section below which one is the most important for you, which has saved you the most time and what do you love the most. Thank you so much for watching this video. Share it with a friend of yours. If you're still watching the comment section, right? I watched till the very end. I will see you all in the next video. 2025 is coming and I'm so excited for this new year. Excited about AI tools and what it can do in this new year. And I will hope that you start using AI tools as well. That's all from me today. I'll see you in the next one.